Hi, I'm Brittany Gelson. I am the Research and Development Coordinator for ProGrain. We have two sites located in Manitoba and two sites in Saskatchewan, and we do all the research here. This, right now we're in Oakville. This is my main site. I have everything here from uh, populations to nurseries uh, to eel trials and breeder ones and twos and demos. So basically we start with the seed after the crosses and the F1s are done. We take that seed and we seed them into our populations. That is single plant selection. So we walk through, we'll take uh, cuts of each or take each plant and then we thresh it and we collect 50 seeds. Then we seed it into our nurseries the next year. Um, the nurseries are used for observation, so just walking through, seeing what the lines are doing, how they're doing in this environment, um, etc. Once we then see the promising lines that are in our uh, trial, we'll then take the seeds and seed it into our observation. The difference between observation and our nurseries is our observation trials are just bigger. Um, that allows us to collect data, look at the plots, see how they're doing, and pick lines that are actually doing really well here. Then we'll take those and we'll take the best of the elites and the preliminaries and we'll seed them into our yield trial. Um, so that's a, a randomized plot, um, as large as it can be, and that's what's actually seeded at our different satellite sites. So we have one in Morden, um, in Saskatchewan we have two, one in Marquee and the other one up in Melfort. So then we'll watch how they grow, we'll take data on them, so like flower color, hair color, um, in harvest then we'll do like lodging, um, just maturity dates, things like that. <laughs> then we look at different things like seed protein and uh, oil, oil content of each seed. Uh, then, if it looks promising again, they will we'll spend the next two years seeding that as breeder ones and breeders twos. So that is the best of the best, trying and we're, for two years we're just trying to get more seed and more seed, see how they do, um, take photos again at the different stages, things like that. Because um, basically our goal is to create the best seed for the producers. So by having these plots in Manitoba and in Saskatchewan, the varieties get used to these soils, our climate, our shorter growing season, and we can pick the best of the best for our producers.